Uh, I always played poker uh, when I was a young lad, but uh, got involved in the Dublin scene. A uh, guy I played bridge with brought me into uh, the Griffin in the late 80s to see if I liked it, and I started playing very regularly from then on. Um, I wouldn't have never gone pro uh, poker without the internet because uh, I always made good money at poker from the early 90s, you know, making maybe between 40 and 60 grand a year for, you know, every year, but it meant combined with a salary, it was a very good, it could give me a good standard of life, but not enough to go pro, but the advent of the internet meant that the amount of hands you play are a lot, lot more, so the earnings went up exactly so I had decided that uh, if I had a couple of good years and got enough of a role together I would give up work and f play full time uh, well it's I'm mostly uh, cash games online so it's a series of wins if you know what I mean uh, Came seventh in the World Series for $135,000, the World Series of Omaha. Um, online, biggest win online probably in a single day was probably about 80000 Biggest loss online in a day was probably about 60000 So. Uh, at the moment, it's uh, I, I started off when I started off playing internet poker, it was with Ladbrokes back in about 2001. And at the moment, it's mostly eye poker uh, with some poker stars. Um, but again, online, you know mostly people from their screen names. Uh, obviously, Dave Callahan is a very, very tough opponent. Um, outside, outside of him, um, certainly recently in the last six months, this guy called Tycoon eighty seven on on I uh, Poker has been a bit of my nemesis. Um, apart from that, it's there's nobody really that I would fear too much. I was following him a bit, but I'm pretty convinced, I could be wrong, um, it's actually, I should be talking about him being the big, biggest opponent, I'm pretty convinced he's the same guy that he is, used to be the Italian style on eye poker, and uh, I had gone through a bad run, um, September, October, November this year, you know, really bad run, and I decided that I... Um, had to do something about it, so I downloaded. I got this Holden Manager thing that has this Omaha software of tracking how you do, and I had all my hands saved on eye poker. And this Italian style, in all the games I played with him during those uh, five months or six months, he was down about five hundred grand, but I was down to him about a hundred grand. So that's bad when he's lost a half a million in the games I played with, and I'm still losing. So this, I, I, I think. Italian style is Isidore, I could be wrong. Again, he's, uh, he was, uh, I think he's broke, or he, he certainly was up 7.5 million on full tilt, and latest was he was down about 600,000. Beer. Football. Sex. Bridge. Well, one time, one time, some, I think it was a casino in Estoril. Uh, no, not Deauville. It was a casino in Deauville. I was at a British tournament there. So we just got drunk 
playing blackjack every night and one or two or three nights in a row and they wouldn't let me into Fortnite. Uh, it's easier. It's easier in bridge because uh, when you're playing bridge. They have a set number of rounds for every session. You're playing for about four hours in a session, so there's normally about eleven rounds. So I usually would like a pint around, but it's a lot more trickier in poker because uh, I would say normally the optimum would be about five pints. Best room I've heard about myself. Um, sometimes so much a win. So, yeah. My bankroll. Fifteen thousand.